In mathematics, a Green's function of an inhomogeneous linear differential operator defined on a domain with specified initial conditions or boundary conditions is its impulse response. This means that if L is the linear differential operator, then the Green's function is the solution for y of the equation Li equals delta, where delta is Dirac's delta function. The solution of the initial value problem Li. Topic f is the convolution g f, where g is the Green's function through the superposition principle, given a linear ordinary differential equation Ode, L solution. Source: One can first solve L green equals delta s for each s, and realizing that since the source is a sum of delta functions, the solution is a sum of Green's functions as well by linearity of L. Green's functions are named after the British mathematician George Green, who first developed the concept in the 1830s. In the modern study of linear partial differential equations, Green's functions are studied largely from the point of view of fundamental solutions instead. Under many body theory, the term is also used in physics, specifically in quantum field theory, aerodynamics, aeroacoustics, electrodynamics, seismology, and statistical field theory, to refer to various types of correlation functions, even those that do not fit the mathematical definition. In quantum field theory, Green's functions take the roles of propagators. Topic. Definition and uses A Green's function, G X, S, of a linear differential operator L equals L X acting on distributions over a subset of the Euclidean space R N display style math bound R N at a point S, is any solution of where delta is the Dirac delta function. This property of a Green's function can be exploited to solve differential equations of the form. If the kernel of L is non-trivial, then the Green's function is not unique. However, in practice, some combination of symmetry, boundary conditions and or other externally imposed criteria will give a unique Green's function. Green's functions may be categorized, by the type of boundary conditions satisfied, by a Green's function number. Also, Green's functions in general are distributions, not necessarily functions of a real variable. Green's functions are also useful tools in solving wave equations and diffusion equations. In quantum mechanics, the Green's function of the Hamiltonian is a key concept with important links to the concept of density of states. As a side note, the Green's function as used in physics is usually defined with the opposite sign, instead, that is, L G X S equals delta X minus S. Display style L G X S equals delta X S. This definition does not significantly change any of the properties of the Green's function due to the evenness of the Dirac delta function. If the operator is translation invariant, that is, when L has constant coefficients with respect to x, then the Green's function can be taken to be a convolution operator, that is, g x s equals g x minus s. Display style g x s equals g x s. In this case, the Green's function is the same as the impulse response of linear time invariant system theory. Topic: Motivation. Loosely speaking, if such a function g can be found for the operator L, then if we multiply the equation 1 for the Green's function by f(s) and then integrate with respect to s, we obtain L G X S F S D S equals delta 
x minus s f s d s equals f x Display style Intel G X S F S D S equals in Delta X S F S D S equals F X. The right hand side is now given by the equation two to be equal to L U X thus L U X equals L G X S F S D S display style lu x equals int l g x s f s d s because the operator l equals l x display style l equals l x is linear and acts on the variable x alone, not on the variable of integration s. One may take the operator L outside of the integration on the right hand side, yielding L U X equals L G X S F S D S Display style lu x equals l left in g x s f s d s right, which suggests. Thus, one may obtain the function u x through knowledge of the Green's function in equation one and the source term on the right-hand side in equation two. This process relies upon the linearity of the operator l. In other words, the solution of equation two u x can be determined by the integration given in equation three. Although f x is known, this integration cannot be performed unless g is also known. The problem now lies in finding the Green's function g that satisfies equation 1. For this reason, the Green's function is also sometimes called the fundamental solution associated to the operator L. Not every operator L admits a Green's function. The Green's function can also be thought of as a right inverse of L. Aside from the difficulties of finding a Green's function for a particular operator, the integral in equation 3 may be quite difficult to evaluate. However, the method gives a theoretically exact result. This can be thought of as an expansion of f according to a Dirac delta function basis, projecting f over delta x minus s, and a superposition of the solution on each projection. Such an integral equation is known as a Fredholm integral equation, the study of which constitutes Fredholm theory. Topic: <laughs> Green's functions for solving inhomogeneous boundary value problems. The primary use of Green's functions in mathematics is to solve non-homogeneous boundary value problems. In modern theoretical physics, Green's functions are also usually used as propagators in Feynman diagrams. The term Green's function is often further used for any correlation function. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Framework. Let L be the Sturm-Liouville operator, a linear differential operator of the form L equals D D X P X D D X plus Q X Display style L equals D F R A C D D X left P X D F R A C D D X right plus Q X and let D be the boundary conditions operator D U equals alpha one U zero plus beta one U zero alpha two U plus beta two U 
Display style do equals begin cases alpha underscore one U zero plus beta underscore one U zero alpha underscore two U L plus beta underscore two U L end cases let F x be a continuous function in zero. Further suppose that the problem LU equals F D U equals zero. Display style begin aligned Lu and equals F do and equals zero end aligned is regular, i.e., only the trivial solution exists for the homogeneous problem. Topic theorem There is one and only one solution U X that satisfies L U equals F D U equals zero. Display style begin aligned Lu and equals F do and equals zero end aligned and it is given by U X equals zero F S G X S D S Display style U X equals in underscore zero carrot L F S G X S D S tilde, where G X S is a Green's function satisfying the following conditions G X S display style G X S is continuous in X display style X and S display style S. For X does not equal S display style X n e q s l g X S equals zero display style L G X S equals zero. For S does not equal zero display style S n e q zero D G X S equals zero. Display style D G X S equals zero. Derivative jump G S plus zero S minus G S minus zero S equals one P S Display style G S underscore plus O S G S underscore minus zero S equals one P S Symmetry G X S equals G S X Display style G X S equals G S X. Topic: Advanced and retarded Green's functions. Sometimes the Green's function can be split into a sum of two functions, one with the variable positive plus and the other with the variable negative. These are the advanced and retarded Green's functions, and when the equation under study depends on time, one of the parts is causal and the other anti-causal. In these problems usually the causal part is the important one. These are frequently the solutions to the inhomogeneous electromagnetic wave equation. Topic. Finding Green's functions Topic. Units While it doesn't uniquely fix the form the Green's function will take, performing a dimensional analysis to find the units a Green's function must have is an important sanity check on any Green's function found through other means. A quick examination of the defining equation L G X S equals Delta X minus S display style L G X S equals Delta X S shows that the units G display style G depend not only on the units of L display style L but also on the number and units of the space of which the position vectors x display style x and s display style s are elements this leads to the relationship g equals l minus 1 d x minus 
1 display style g equals l caret minus 1 mathrm d x caret minus 1 where g display style g is defined as the physical units of g display style g and d x display style mathrm d x is the volume element of the space or spacetime for example if l equals t 2 display style l equals partial underscore t caret 2 and time is the only variable then l equals t i m e minus 2 display style l equals mathrm time caret minus 2 d x equals t i m e a n d display style mathrm d x equals mathrm time mathrm and G equals T I M E display style G equals mathrm time. If L equals white medium square equals one C two T two Minus two display style L equals square equals frac one C carrot two partial underscore T carrot two nabla carrot two the D'Alembert operator and space has three dimensions then L equals L E N G T H Minus two display style L equals mathrm length carrot minus two D X equals T I M E L E N G T H three a N D Display style Mathrum D x equals Mathrum time Mathrum length carrot three Mathrum and G equals T I M E minus one L E N G T H minus one display style G equals mathrm time carrot minus one mathrm length carrot minus one. Topic eigenvalue expansions. If a differential operator L admits a set of eigenvectors ψ n x, i.e., a set of functions ψ n and scalars λ n such that L ψ n equals λ n ψ n that is complete, then it is possible to construct a Green's function from these eigenvectors and eigenvalues. Complete means that the set of functions ψ n satisfies the following completeness relation Delta x minus X equals N equals zero infinity psi N X psi N X Display style delta x x equals sum underscore n equals zero carrot inf t psi underscore n carrot dagger x psi underscore n x. Then the following holds, where 
display style dagger represents complex conjugation applying the operator l to each side of this equation results in the completeness relation which was assumed the general study of the Green's function written in the above form, and its relationship to the function spaces formed by the eigenvectors, is known as Fredholm theory. There are several other methods for finding Green's functions, including the method of images, separation of variables, and Laplace transforms Cole 2011. Topic. Combining Green's functions If the differential operator L display style L can be factored as L equals L one L two display style L equals L underscore one L underscore two, then the Green's function of L display style L can be constructed from the Green's functions for L one display style L underscore one and L two display style L underscore two G X S equals G two X S one G one S one S D S one Display style G X S equals in G underscore two X S underscore one G underscore one S underscore one S math from D S underscore one The above identity follows immediately from taking G X S display style G X S to be the representation of the right operator inverse of L display style L analogous to how for the invertible linear operator C display style C defined by C equals a B minus one equals B minus one a minus one Display style C equals A B carrot minus one equals B carrot minus one A carrot minus one is represented by its matrix elements C I J display style C underscore I J a further identity follows for differential operators that are scalar polynomials of the derivative L equals P n X display style L equals P underscore n partial underscore X the fundamental theorem of algebra combined with the fact that X display style partial underscore X commutes with itself guarantees that the polynomial can be factored putting L display style L in the form L equals I equals 1 n X minus Z I Display style L equals prod underscore I equals one carrot N partial underscore X Z underscore I where Z I display style Z underscore I are the zeros of P N Z display style P underscore N Z taking the Fourier transform of L G X S equals Delta X minus 
S display style LG X S equals Delta X S with respect to both X display style X and S display style S gives G carrot K X K S equals Delta K X minus K S I equals one N I K X minus Z I Display style wide hat G K underscore X K underscore S equals frac delta K underscore X K underscore S prod underscore I equals one carrot N ik underscore X Z underscore I The fraction can then be split into a sum using a partial fraction decomposition before Fourier transforming back to X Display style X and S Display style s space. This process yields identities that relate integrals of Green's functions and sums of the same. For example, if L equals x plus gamma x plus alpha two. Display style L equals partial underscore x plus gamma partial underscore x plus alpha carrot two. Then one form for its Green's function is G x s equals one alpha minus gamma two theta x minus S E minus Gamma X minus S minus one alpha minus Gamma two theta X minus S E minus Alpha x minus s plus one gamma minus alpha theta x minus s x minus s e minus Alpha x minus s equals theta x minus s one x minus s one e minus alpha x Minus S one theta S one minus S E minus Gamma S one minus S D S one Display style begin align G X S and equals frac one alpha gamma carrot two theta X S operator name E carrot gamma X S frac one alpha gamma carrot two theta X S operator name E carrot alpha X S plus frac one gamma alpha 
theta xs xs operator name e carrot alpha xs 5 pt and equals in theta xs underscore 1 xs underscore 1 operator name e carrot alpha xs underscore 1 theta s underscore 1 s operator name e carrot gamma s underscore 1 s math from t s underscore 1 end aligned while the example presented is tractable analytically it illustrates a process that works when the integral is not trivial for example when 2 display style nabla caret 2 is the operator in the polynomial topic table of green's functions the following table gives an overview of green's functions of frequently appearing differential operators where r equals x 2 plus y 2 plus z 2 display style text style r equals sqrt x caret 2 plus y caret 2 plus z caret 2 row equals x 2 plus y 2 Display style text style row equals sqrt x caret two plus y caret two theta t display style text style theta t is the heavy side step function j nu z display style text style j underscore nu z is a Bessel function i New Z display style text style i underscore new Z is a modified Bessel function of the first kind and k new Z display style text style k underscore new Z is a modified Bessel function of the second kind. Where time t appears in the first column, the advanced causal Green's function is listed. Topic: <laughs> Green's functions for the Laplacian. Green's functions for linear differential operators involving the Laplacian may be readily put to use using the second of Green's identities. To derive Green's theorem, begin with the divergence theorem, otherwise known as Gauss's theorem. V a d v equals s a d sigma caret display style in underscore v nabla c d o t v e c a d v equals in underscore s v e c a c d o t d wide hat sigma tilde let a equals phi psi minus psi phi Display style VEC a equals Vafi Nabla psi psi Nabla Vafi and substitute into Gauss law. Compute a display style Nabla C D O T VEC a and apply the product rule for the operator a equals phi psi minus Psi phi equals phi psi plus phi two psi minus phi psi minus psi two phi equals phi Two psi minus psi 
2 phi display style begin aligned nabla c d o t v e c a and equals nabla c d o t va phi nabla psi psi nabla va phi and equals nabla va phi c d o t nabla psi plus va phi nabla caret 2 psi nabla va phi c d o t nabla psi psi nabla caret 2 va phi and equals va phi nabla caret 2 psi psi nabla caret Carrot two var phi end aligned. Plugging this into the divergence theorem produces Green's theorem v phi two psi minus psi two phi dv equals s phi psi minus psi phi d sigma carrot. Display style int underscore v var phi nabla carrot two psi psi nabla carrot two var phi dv equals int underscore s var phi nabla psi psi nabla var phi c d o t d white hat sigma. Suppose that the linear differential operator L is the Laplacian squared, and that there is a Green's function g for the Laplacian. The defining property of the Green's function still holds Lg x x equals 2g x x equals delta x minus x. Display style Lg x x equals nabla caret 2 g x x equals delta x x. Let psi equals g. Display style psi equals g. In Green's second identity, see Green's identities. Then V phi x delta x minus x minus g x x two phi x d three x equals s phi x g x x minus g x x phi x d sigma carrot Display style in underscore v left var phi x delta x x g x x nabla carrot two var phi x right d carrot three x equals in underscore s left var phi x nabla g x x g x x nabla var phi x right c d o t d white hat sigma. Using this expression, it is possible to solve Laplace's equation two phi x. Topic zero or Poisson's equation two phi x minus rho x subject to either Newman or Dirichlet boundary conditions. In other words, we can solve for phi x everywhere inside a volume where either one the value of phi x is specified on the bounding surface of the volume Dirichlet boundary conditions, or two the normal derivative of phi x is specified on the bounding surface Newman boundary conditions. Suppose the problem is to solve for phi x inside the region. Then the integral v phi x Delta x minus x d three x display style int limits underscore v var phi x delta x x d caret three x reduces to simply phi x due to the defining property of the Dirac delta function, and we have phi x equals Minus v g x x rho x d three x plus s phi x g x x minus g X x phi x d 
sigma carrot display style var phi x equals int underscore v g x x row x d carrot three x plus int underscore s left var phi x nabla g x x g x x nabla var phi x right c d o t d white hat sigma this form expresses the well-known property of harmonic functions, that if the value or normal derivative is known on a bounding surface, then the value of the function inside the volume is known everywhere. In electrostatics, phi x is interpreted as the electric potential ρ x as electric charge density, and the normal derivative phi x d sigma carrot Display style nabla var phi x c d o t d white hat sigma as the normal component of the electric field. If the problem is to solve a Dirichlet boundary value problem, the Green's function should be chosen such that g x x vanishes when either x or x is on the bounding surface. Thus, only one of the two terms in the surface integral remains. If the problem is to solve a Newman boundary value problem, the Green's function is chosen such that its normal derivative vanishes on the bounding surface, as it would seem to be the most logical choice. See Jackson J.D. Classical Electrodynamics, page 39. However, application of Gauss's theorem to the differential equation defining the Green's function yields S G X X D sigma carrot equals v two g x x d three x equals v delta x minus x D three x equals one. Display style in underscore s nabla g x x c d o t d wide hat sigma equals in underscore v nabla carrot two g x x d carrot three x equals in underscore v delta x x d carrot three x equals one tilde meaning the normal derivative of g x, x cannot vanish on the surface, because it must integrate to 1 on the surface. Again, see Jackson JD Classical Electrodynamics, page 39 for this and the following argument. The simplest form the normal derivative can take is that of a constant, namely 1, s, where s is the surface area of the surface. The surface term in the solution becomes s phi x g x x d sigma caret equals phi s display style in underscore s var phi x nabla g x x c d o t d white hat sigma equals langle var phi wrangle underscore s where phi S display style Langle Vafi Wrangle underscore S is the average value of the potential on the surface. This number is not known in general, but is often unimportant, as the goal is often to obtain the electric field given by the gradient of the potential rather than the potential itself. With no boundary conditions, the Green's function for the Laplacian Green's function for the three variable Laplace equation is G x x equals minus one four pi x minus x display style G x x equals dfrac one four pi x x Supposing that the bounding surface goes out to infinity and plugging in this expression for the Green's function finally yields the standard expression for electric potential in terms of electric charge density as Topic Example Example 
Find the Green function for the following problem, whose Green's function number is x11, LU equals U, plus K2 U equals F, X, U, 0 equals 0, U, Pi 2 K equals 0. Display style begin aligned lu and equals u plus k carrot two u equals f x u zero and equals zero quad u left tfrac pi two k right equals zero end aligned first step the Green's function for the linear operator at hand is defined as the solution to g x s plus k two grams x s equals delta x minus s display style g x s plus k carrot two g x s equals delta Xs. If x does not equal s, display style x n e q s, then the delta function gives zero, and the general solution is g x s equals c one cos k x plus c two sin k x. Display style g x s equals c underscore one cos k x plus c underscore two sin k x for x s. Display style x. The boundary condition at x equals zero. Display style x equals zero implies g zero s equals c one one plus c two zero equals zero c one equals zero. Display style g zero s equals c underscore one c d o t one plus c underscore two c d o t zero equals zero. Quad C underscore one equals zero. If X S display style X and S does not equal Pi two K display style S N E Q T F R A C Pi two K for X greater than S display style X greater than S the boundary condition at X equals Pi Two K display style x equals tfrac pi two K implies g pi two K s equals c three zero plus c four one equals zero C four equals zero Display style G left TFRAC Pi two K S right equals C underscore three C D O T zero plus C underscore four C D O T one equals zero quad C underscore four equals zero The equation of G zero S equals zero. Display style g zero s equals zero is skipped for similar reasons. To summarize the results thus far, g x s equals c two sin k x for x s c three cos k x for s x. Display style g x s equals begin cases c underscore two sin k x and text for x second step. The next task is to determine c two display style c underscore two and c three display style c underscore three. Ensuring continuity in the Green's function at x equals s display style x equals s implies C two sin K S equals C three cos K S display style C underscore two sin K S equals C underscore three cos K S one can ensure proper discontinuity in the first derivative by integrating the defining differential equation from x equals s minus epsilon display style x equals s var epsilon to x equals s plus epsilon Display style x equals s plus var epsilon, and taking the limit as epsilon display style var epsilon goes to zero. 
C three minus K sin K S minus C two K cos K S equals one Display style C underscore three C D O T K sin K S C underscore two C D O T K cos K S equals one. The two discontinuity equations can be solved for C two Display style C underscore two and C Three display style c underscore three to obtain c two equals minus cos k s k c three equals minus sin k s k display style c underscore two equals frac cos k s k quad quad c underscore three equals frac sin k s k. So the Green's function for this problem is g x s equals minus cos k s k sin k x x s minus sin k s k cos k x s x. Display style g x s equals begin cases frac cos k s k sin k x and x end cases. Topic: Further examples. Let n equals one and let the subset be all of let L be d d x. Display style mathrm d mathrm d x. Then the heavy side step function h x minus x zero is a Green's function of l at x zero. Let n. Topic two and let the subset be the quarter plane x y x y zero and l be the Laplacian. Also, assume a Dirichlet boundary condition is imposed at x. Zero and a Newman boundary condition is imposed at y equals zero. Then the x one o y two o Green's function is g x y x zero y zero equals one two pi plane x Minus x zero two plus y minus y zero two minus plane x plus x zero two plus Y minus Y zero two plus plane X minus X zero two plus Y plus Y zero two minus Plane x plus x zero two plus y plus y zero two display style begin aligned g x y x underscore zero y underscore zero equals d f r a c one two pi and left plane s q r t x x underscore zero carrot two plus y y underscore zero carrot two plane s q r t x plus x underscore zero carrot two plus y y underscore zero carrot two right five p t and left plus plane s Q R T X X underscore zero carrot two plus Y plus Y underscore zero carrot two plane S Q R T X plus X underscore zero carrot two plus Y plus Y underscore zero carrot two right end aligned let A X B display style A and all three are elements of the real numbers. Then for any function from reals to reals F X display style F X with an 
n display style n th derivative that is integrable over the interval a b display style a b f x equals m equals 0 n minus 1 x minus a m m d m f d x m x equals a plus a b x minus s n minus one n minus one theta x minus s d n f d x n x equals s d s Display style begin aligned f x and equals sum underscore m equals zero carrot n one frac x a carrot m m left frac mathrm d carrot m f mathrm d x carrot m right underscore x equals a plus in underscore a carrot b left frac x s carrot n one n one theta x s right left frac mathrm d carrot n f mathrm d x carrot n right underscore x equals s mathrm d S end aligned tilde. The Green's function in the above equation G X S equals X minus S N minus one N minus one theta x minus s display style g x s equals frac x s caret n one n one theta x s is not unique. How is the equation modified if g x minus s display style g x s is added to g X S display style G X S where G X display style G X satisfies D N G D X N equals zero Display style frac mathrm d caret n g mathrm d x caret n equals zero for all x element of a b display style x in a b for example g x equals minus x two Display style g x equals x two with n equals two. Display style n equals two. Also, compare the above equation to the form of a Taylor series centered at x equals a. Display style x equals a. Equals equals. See also.